Hello there. Today I got one numerical from trigonometry, and the question is tan m by two equals to root six plus root two minus root three minus two. And to prove this, we take here LHS tan a by. Uh, if this fifteen by two, if you consider this fifteen by two as tan a by two, then we can use the relation sub sub multiple angle of relation here. <coughs> tan a by two equals to one minus cos a by sine a. So I used here formula tan fifteen by two equals to one minus cos a by sine a. <coughs> and now. Since we don't know the uh, value of cos 15, we change this cos 15 and sin 15 into the standard value like this. 1 minus cos, this 15 can be written as 60 minus 60 minus 45 because 60 minus 45 is 15. In the similar way, sin 15 can also be written as 60 minus 45. Now it seems easier. I just use another formula cos a minus b and sin a minus b here so i'm using here the formula this if this is 60 is a and 45 is b then we can use here cos a minus b formula that is the formula of cos a minus b is cos a cos b plus sin a sin b so i use here cos a a is 60 and cos a cos b and cos b is 45 degree sorry and plus and sin a sin b sin a into sin b and in a similar way use the formula for sin a minus b which is sin a into cos b minus cos a into sin b cos a into sin b now we have already used the formula here now all we have to do is just put the standard value of 60 and 45 degree here. So if we multiply, uh, if we open this bracket by multiplying with minus, then this should become here minus and value of cos 60 is 1 by 2 into cos 45 is 1 by root 2. The similar way minus into plus minus here. Sin 60 is root 3 by 2. Sin 45 is also 1 by root 2. And next is again in the similar way put value here also sin 60 is root 3 by 2 into cos 45 is 1 by root 2 minus is minus here and cos 60 is 1 by 2 into sin 45 is 1 by root 2 now just solve it <coughs> now if we take the 2 root 2 lcm here from the uh, above from above if we take a 2 root 2 lcm here then we get here 2 root 2 if you take the LCM and multiply this one, then you are you get two root two minus two root two and two root two get cancelled. So here one into one is one minus, and here also two root two and two root two get cancelled. So root three is root three here. And for below here, here also we can take two root two LCM here. Two root two. If you take the two root two LCM, there is the common LCM. So you can directly write here root 3 minus 1 into 1 is 1 here and now you can see here you can directly uh, cancel this and this or you can also do by reciprocal process <coughs> and now we got here 2 root 2 minus 1 minus root 3 that is 2 root 2 minus 1 minus root 3 by root 3 minus 1 since we don't need anything in the denominator in answer so we try to cancel this denominator so to remove this denominator we rationalize here if you rationalize here root 3 plus 1 by root 3 plus 1 after rationalization just multiply here if we multiply here 2 root 2 into root 3 is 2 root 6 and 2 root 2 into 1 is plus 2 root 2 again multiply it 1 to all this on uh, both this term minus root 3 minus 1 also multiply by this minus root 3 to this both term minus 3 and minus root 3 this is simply the multiplication process i just multiply here by this 3 term to this 2 term now to the below you can see here root 3 minus 1 root 3 plus 1 simply we can use the formula a square minus b square this is a minus b a plus b that means a square minus b square now uh, let's try to simplify this 
2 root 6 we can't do 2 root 6 anything else so write it as it is and there is also 2 root 2 write it as it is here is minus root 3 and minus root 3 if we add minus root 3 and minus root 3 we get here minus 2 root 3 and minus 1 and minus 3 is added so minus 4 here now i can direct we can directly do here root 3 squared is 3 and 1 squared is 1 so 3 minus 1 is 2 now if we take the two common from these all terms if we take the common two from these all terms we get here root 6 plus root 2 minus root 3 minus 2 sorry minus 2 and now there is 2 here you can simply cancel this 2 and 2 so here we got the answer root 6 plus root 2 minus root 3 minus 2 equals to areas yes proved that's it thanks so much